Pact, who had been generating some buzz, has gone cold of late. All right, this is pretty much from the last game. It's just said I've been cold as of late. T Rock, how do you explain your game falling off the way it has lately? Because the freaking AI is freaking retarded in this game, and it won't want not freaking let me strike out anyone. And every time they hit it, it's freaking a single or freaking a home run. And if I throw a ball, they always hold up like they're freaking magicians. Come on. Freaking stupid is what that is. Freaking that option's not in here. Of course not. There had been some speculation that you might be close to being called up to the majors. Do you think this will hurt those chances? Once a player catches the public's eye, little he does, good or bad, will go unnoticed. Thank you, t -Rock. Good luck. Alright, time to meet this or gay YouTube will give me a copyright. Alright. Alright, let's see how I do here. Freaking gay AI, AI will get freaking nonsense again. Baseball is live and on the air on the show. Tonight it's the first of four between the Gwinnett Braves and the Charlotte Knights. It's baseball, it's the show, and it comes your way next. Alex Rodriguez is in to start things off here as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. And here's a ball hit in the air. But this will wind up being a foul ball. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Whoa, really? Stayed too low, apparently. My god, that's the freaking kind of crap I mean. Well, Look at that! Just missed the inside corner. Come on! All even at 2 and 2. Here it is. And a ball popped foul to the right side, out of play. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at three and two. Hit in the air out to center field. Tilson is in pursuit. <sighs> and this deflects right off him. Throw into second. Throw won't get him. That's what you want your leadoff hitter to do every time. He wastes a lot of pitches, makes the pitcher work, then to cap it off, he drives one for a double. That might be one of the best at bats we'll see all game long. A scoop with the Oh my god. Almost a remarkable I'm getting freaking mad with this stupid game. Now with the plate, Henry Fernandez. As you get a look at his current righty lefty splits entering. Oh my god! Every time! Come on! I'm freaking tired of the stupid AI! This is a message, and maybe it's been signed. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Matt, this is how you want to start a game. First inning, you already jump on them early. You get one run in, and now you have two other runners on base. You come Give me a here. freaking break really already. A right here in this game in the first inning. Just a bit jumpy that time. Swung on and missed. With two strikes now and a runner at first. Do you go for the strikeout, or are you still looking for the double play ball? Well, Matt, I think a lot of that depends on the type of pitcher that you are. If you're a power pitcher, you can go ahead and ride a fastball up in the zone, but if you're a guy that induces a lot of ground balls with a sinker, I think you have to stick with that plan. Anthony Wrecker comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. First and third, you know he's going to do everything he can on the mound to roll up a double play ball. On the other side, he's got to be looking for a mistake up in the zone that he can drive in the air and pick up a sack fly at the very least. So he got him swinging. Anthony Wrecker is the second out of the Nine opening second. frame. Third baseman. And this we pitch is taken on the inner half for strike one. Runners on first and third, two away. 
swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0-2 now. Now that's a nice pitch. He ran that in there about mid-90s and put it past him. Off the plate at 94, 1 and 2. Here's the 1 and 2 delivery. And a big strike out there as they'll leave a couple of runners on base. And after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. Now at the plate, Ronnier Mustelier. He did not play last well, night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. Lifted in the air out towards the left side. Uh. He's going to kick off the second with extra bases. And he is in there safely as he starts the second with a double. There's no question he's been struggling at the dish lately, trying to do anything to get himself going. So he's got to feel pretty good after that double. Not to take anything away from him, but I think I could have probably hit that pitch. Yeah, that's one of those gift pitches, not the location he was Come shooting. Come on! And the Nowhere where I want it to be. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch. Hits softly on the ground to first. Matola Got it. takes it in. And he'll take this to the bag himself for the first out, but it's a productive one as the runner moves up to third. Ready now, Rob right. Frederick. Right and as you take a look at the right. splits here, he's Frederick. actually better against right-handed pitching this season. One out and a runner on third. Swing and a line drive. Oh my God! Again with this garbage! Oh my God! And he is in there with an RBI safe. That's a ball he worked on all day. I was out here early. He stayed with it and just shot it the other way. Beautiful three. execution of a game. Hey. Alex Rodriguez. Rodriguez. We'll stand in Freaking for the second stupid, time. man. Strike. It's nothing in one. That misses wide. God, my favorite mode in this game is Diamond Dynasty because the AI is so retarded in this game. It's always been retarded. Whether it's freaking rubber banding or their freaking spectacular vision. Oh my. I'm about to throw my freaking controller at this freaking TV screen. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> I hate this game so much. Oh, this game, this freaking game. He looks at That's freaking game. In there for strike one. I like that take right there. I know it's a strike, but man, they're making him work. He's been struggling early, and now they're making him work even more. And he's in the second safely with a stolen base. I just love games that freaking irritate the heck out of me. I just love it. the string on the circle change. One and two. One out and a runner on second base. Chopped weakly to the left. Throw it! Oh my. Freaking stupid game! I hate it! Is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one. Well, he's got a high pitch count, and we're only in the second inning. Things are definitely not going his way. They're really making him work right now. Sent in the air out to straightaway central. Tilson is there, two gone. Ready for another chance. Ryan Keyes, and we'll see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home so far this inning. In there, 0 and 1. Second pitch is chopped foul right at home plate, and he's behind now 0-2. Tell you what, that was a nice swing after the sequence, falling a fastball to get a changeup, and you foul it off. Pretty good approach. Two down, runners at first and second. And a big strike out there as they'll leave a couple of runners on base, and after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. Stepping in and ready for another shot. For Anthony Gwinnett. Record. Natural. 0 for 1 for Anthony him here in this one. Record. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Now the 0 1. Zero. Looks like he swung it underwater that time for strike two. Now the 0 2 pitch. And he takes strike three cold on the fastball. One gone. Digging in to try it again. Rio Ruiz, 0 for 1 here in the early going. 
And a changeup here misses off the corner to start him out. It's ball one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. One out now, one out. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Started to chase there. They'll appeal it down to third, and no swing. It's ball two. Bases are empty, one man out. And this is going to be a foul ball. Oof, that was a good pitch to hit. He wants that one back. He was just a little bit late on it. And a swing and a miss and another punch out here six already and that's out number two. Stepping in Ronnie or Mustelier first two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out so we'll see if he can fare any better. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Oh and he's finding his groove out there now it's 0 and 2. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. <sighs> Striding in once again, Leading off Blake Lolly comes First into this at bat 0 for Blake. 1 in the ball game. Lally. Up and away to start the inning, it's 1 and 0. Now here it comes. And that pitch catches the inside corner. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Ball two. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Oh my God. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. There's a changeup over the outside corner. Well, that changeup right there sets up a lot of things. Now the count's two and two. He can come back in with a fastball, and it's going to look like it's moving a little bit better. Or he can go back to that changeup. Hacker backs up a bit, and he takes charge for the first out. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Now Rob Frederick. Rob a fastball Frederick. down near the shoe tops. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. A swing and a miss at a ball down. One out, nobody on. Fouled back. To two balls and two strikes now. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. The 2 2 one more time. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out of the ball game. Digging in once again, Alex Rodriguez. He doubled earlier and carries a two for two line into this appearance. Now a cutter, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground, but a foul ball, one and one. Here's the one and one delivery. Now an off speed pitch well inside, and it forces him to bounce away from danger. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. Bases are empty here with two men out. Look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. Micah Johnson would be next if they can keep this inning alive. Mine to the right side. That gets down and the inning continues. Well, there's a little two-out base hit. Maybe start a little two-out rally. Now, he's giving up some runs. He's a little vulnerable. We've seen him give up runs already in this game. So maybe this is a start of something big. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But this is foul for the first strike. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. And he lays off for ball one. He's certainly giving up plenty of hits in this one. But the funny thing is he hasn't walked anyone yet. That tells me he's throwing strikes, but he's just not throwing enough. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Pedro Castro. Four to two, the final score tonight. Brian Mata earns his fifth winner of the year. Mo Money. Uh, this game has not been making me very happy. I haven't had freaking fun with this game. Freaking. Well, I think the last time I had fun with this game was when I played Diamond Dynasty. I haven't had fun with Road to the Show or Franchise for a while now.